Patrick Evans. A beautiful view of El Paseo as dusk sets in across the Coachella Valley on this Saturday evening. We are expecting another warm day tomorrow, but the good news is progressing into next week. We start to see numbers come back down to at or below seasonal averages, so it promises to be a little more comfortable out there. Skies are clear right now, and we're going to hold on to that high pressure building in over the next couple of days. But the ridge that's going to set up is not quite the same kind of pattern that we saw last week, so less in the way of humidity, drier conditions, much more traditional desert weather for us. We got up to 108 today and we've cooled off now to 105 in Palm Springs. We're at 103 in La Quinta and Indio, also in Thermal and Mecca. So the number is getting a little more comfortable this evening. If you compare the last 24 hours to today, we're still actually a little bit warmer than we were yesterday at this hour. However, I think that even into tomorrow, we're going to start to see some improvement. We're likely still going to get up to 108, but the atmosphere is a little drier and will continue to dry out through tomorrow. Winds coming in now out of the north and west coming through the uh, pass, and that's a drying influence on the atmosphere. So we're going to continue to see the dew points drop down incrementally over the next couple of days. Right now, those dew points not exactly in the range we like to see. They're still in the 50s, but it's a whole lot better. Remember, just a day or two ago, we were looking at dew points in the upper 60s and low 70s, and that resulted in thunder showers. Obviously, that didn't happen today. So drier air is slowly filtering in. It is a process. It takes a little while to dry out the atmosphere. But once we get that nice dry air in place, not only will we hold on to that, we'll also see the temperatures cooling off a little bit. Uh, the future cast showcasing clear skies. I don't think we have any real worries about cloud cover. Maybe some coastal clouds. Tonight, the numbers will be slowly cooling down into the 80s. We should be down into the 80s after uh, maybe even by 10 o'clock, but uh, I think uh, that may be a touch optimistic because it's still pretty warm out there at 105. Looking ahead, if you are planning to get on the golf links tomorrow, earlier is better because we're still going to warm up to about 108. If I were to play golf, that's probably the number I'd shoot, uh, unfortunately, but I anticipate Anticipate temperatures coming down into next week. In fact, let's take a look at our Comfort Air 7-day forecast. And over the next few days, all right, Monday, not a big improvement, but down to 107. 104 on Tuesday, and that's the seasonal average. And look what happens Wednesday into the weekend. We get down into the lower 100s. We might even be flirting with. I've been looking at some models, and they indicate maybe Thursday and Friday we're going to be in the upper 90s. So that's a great deal better. And that's a nice 10-degree swing, and we'd love to see that. Let's go back over to the anchor desk and Jen. I would certainly enjoy that, Patrick. So I'm, I'm hoping that model uh, brings us some good news. You're, you're not alone. I think a <laughs> lot of people would enjoy the upper 90s. <laughs> I agree. Look forward to that. All right. Well, we're going to take a quick break, but we'll be back with more coverage, including our coverage of 9-11. You're watching News Channel 3, the desert's news leader.